Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In this lecture, we will discuss about the dehumidification of air using spun hyses. So, uh, actually, sometimes the air consists of a large amount of water molecule. So, we want to remove the water from air to become dry air. So, uh, we will in this lecture we will uh, dehumidify dehumidify air. Uh, with the help of spun hyses. So open the spun hyses and click on new click on new template it will take some time so this is the component list click on add and add the component so air consists of water molecule and the humid air we have humid air so it is air and water Now click on fluid package. So click on add. And here you select select the property package. So I'm selecting some property package like Finn Robinson or NRTL or IDL gas. So I'm using the Finn Robinson equation of state. And now click on the simulation. So select material streams. This is the feed stream, which is the humid air and the relative humidity of air is 60% suppose it is 60% air relative humidity of air is 60% 60% water is present in the air uh, this air this is humid air that will pass through uh, first of all this air will uh, uh, we will compress this air with the help of compressor so we will select a compressor this is compressor to increase its temperature and velocity so we increased uh, this is a compressor now this compressed air will pass through uh, some cooler so to to decrease its temperature because this compressor increase the temperature of humid air so after that compression we will cool the air so we will select a cooler cooler after cooling the air will pass through the separation column uh, separation column so this is a separator simple separator so this air will pass through a separator and we will obtain the top product the top air the air will come out from the top of the separator and the water will come out from the bottom of the separator and this air then will pass through a well so we will select a control well this is a control well so now click on stream number one and define it so this stream name is it is this is the humid air humid air and the temperature of the humid air is suppose the humid air is uh, entering to the compressor at 20 degrees centigrade and one atmospheric pressure one atmospheric pressure the mass flow rate of the air is uh, humid air is Suppose the mass flow rate of the humid air is uh, 3600 kg per hour. So it shows unknown composition. Now click on composition. So this is a humid air. The humidity of the air is uh, 60%. Suppose the humidity of air is 60%. 60% and 40% is water. So we want dry air. So this is a humid air which is 60% water and 40% air so it is specified now close this one click on the compressor double click on compressor the inlet to the compressor is humid air and the outlet so this is the compressor outlet compressor outlet okay require energy stream so compressor energy compressor energy okay now close this one this is the compressor energy this is cooler so now the air will pass through the cooler so this compressor will compress and it will increase the pressure of the humid air to suppose that uh, the, the the pressure of this air is suppose i am entering some value the compressor 
the humid air which coming out from the compressor is suppose it is at uh, three at three atmospheric pressure. Suppose it is at three atmospheric pressure. Okay. Now this compressed air will pass through a cooler. So double click on cooler. The inlet of the cooler is the compressor outlet and the cooler outlet. This is the cooler cooler outlet. Cooler outlet. Require energy. So energy of the cooler. Now unknown delta V. So so unknown delta P there is no pressure drop the condenser okay close this one now <clears throat> this is the compressed humid air this compressed humid air is 43 degrees centigrade and this humid air is a 20 degrees centigrade now we will uh, enter this at suppose at 25 degrees centigrade in cooler we will cool it to 25 degrees centigrade you can cool it to 20 degrees centigrade depend on your problem <clears throat> so this is just an example you can enter some other temperature so the cooler outlet is at 20 degrees centigrade 20 degrees centigrade okay now this is the cooler outlet this cold humid air will pass through a separator double click on separator and inlet of the separator is cooler outlet and this is the uh, dry air dry air coming out from the top of the separator and this is the water water close this one and this is a well so double click on the well inlet to the well is the dry air and outlet of the this is the well outlet so it shows unknown delta p so the well will, de will decrease the, the pressure of this this stream this dry air the pressure of this dry air will decrease through this well so here the pressure is 304 kilopascal so i am decreasing this to one atmospheric pressure or uh, 100 kilopascal or one at atm so suppose this the this stream the dry air pressure is which is coming out from the well is uh, 1 atm 1 atm okay okay now you can see now double click on this stream and here check the composition so it is 99 percent air it is dry air and it is 0 0.7 percent is water and 99.23 percent is air so it is a dry air and here you can see this is water water so click on composition it is one percent hundred percent water and there is no air in the water so this is all about that how can we remove the water from the air uh, in the s1 high thank you very much for your attention if you are new to the channel please like and subscribe